Hey everyone, it's Courtney with Salt Strong, and today I just want to talk to you about something that I am really passionate about. And it's not just because I love to fish on the beach, but it's also because I really do believe that it's our responsibility to make sure that our environment is clean and safe for us today and for many, many years to come. And the concept of pack it in and pack it out really is just make sure that everything that you're taking with you to the beach, that you take back with you when you leave. And it's a no trace leave behind mentality that we need to have in order to keep our environment safe and clean for us, for fellow anglers, for anybody visiting the beach, for the children that are playing on the beach, and for the wildlife that is using the beach to forage, to reproduce, and to create their habitat. And so I just want to go over a couple of items that you may take with you to the beach, but you may not know how long it actually takes to break down. So I'll quickly go through those items and what that looks like as far as time goes. So paper, any kind of paper products that you may have, two to six weeks. Cardboard, three months. Something like an orange peel could be two years. Chewing gum can be five years. Plastic wrappers, such as a granola bar wrapper, five years. Cigarette butts, 10 years. Plastic bags. Now, I always have a plastic bag with me because I'm going to leave the beach cleaner when I leave than how I found it. But a plastic bag could take 10 to 20 years to break down. Wet wipes, 100 years. Baby diapers. It's so much fun to see kids having a great time playing on the beach. Baby diapers can be 450 years before they break down. Aluminum cans, although it is recyclable, 200 years. Plastic bottles, depending on the type of plastic that they're made out of, anywhere from 100 to 1,000 years. And last but not least, fishing line. As anglers, we're all using fishing line. We all get snags. We all get tangles that we have to cut out. But make sure that you're taking any fishing line that you had to cut out with you because fishing line can take up to 600 years to break down. And we've all seen the birds and sea turtles and the tragic photos of animals having fishing line wrapped around their necks, around their wings, around their fins. It really is sad and we need to make sure that we are protecting our environment and our wildlife. And so I hope that this was enlightening and you learned a little bit about how long it takes certain items to break down. And if you're new to Salt Strong, just know that we're the best online fishing club in America because we actually guarantee you'll catch more fish while saving time and money. We do this by providing you with our premium education, an exclusive online insider community, and huge discounts on the best tackle for saltwater anglers. To learn more, go to saltstrong.com, and we hope to see you in the insider family soon.